Hello there. Today I'm painting a little snowy winter scene entitled A Bicycle for Christmas. If you would like to paint along, these are all the colours I'll be using. Burnt Sienna, Phthalo Blue, Yellow Ochre, Mars Black, Titanium White, Orange and Cadmium Yellow. So let's get started. The first colour mix is Burnt Sienna and some black. I'm going to use this for the dark shaded areas of the brickwork. As you can see, I've roughly sketched out a house, a wall and a little archway. Now pick up some burnt sienna and blend this in with the darker shade. Just block it all in. I've decided to put in some black outlines just as a wee experiment to see what it looks like and I'm using a fine liner brush for this. I've also had the idea to create a line of capstones along the wall here. I want a dark evening sky for this painting at a time when everyone's deciding to switch on their living room lights. So I'm mixing up some phthalo blue with a little black. Then I'll keep on adding touches of white until I just get the shade that I want. There, that will do nicely. Add some white to the mix, blend it in with the darker shade and work my way down. A little more white. And that will do for now. I've decided to put another layer of paint on the brickwork uh, to give it a more solid look. So it's just the same colours as before. Some more outlining with my fine liner brush. And burnt sienna for the chimney pots. And don't forget to make them nice and wonky looking. Mix up some yellow ochre and a little black now. And let's have some fun painting in the brickwork pointing. I'm adding some yellow ochre here just to vary the colour a little. If you've watched any of my other videos you'll know that I do this quite often. I just think that it adds a little more interest to the painting. So I've replaced the white on the wall with burnt sienna and I'm painting over the black now with yellow ochre and black mix. This will make the wall and archway tie in nicely with the yellow pointing on the house. To create a hill I'm brushing on white with my flat bristle brush. Then I'll pull the colour down until it fades away at the bottom and there you've got an instant snowy hill. Alright, I've decided to put another background hill in, placing it just behind the one I've just done. So that's thalo blue and black with some white. There we go, job done. I'm really pleased the way this archway's turned out. 
and will make a nice escape for the eye into the background hills. Black for the top windows and I'm going to make them little squares. This is where the little boy lives and his bedroom window is the one nearest the chimney. And for the base colour of the bottom windows and door, yellow ochre. Thalo blue for the door. And the reason for painting the door yellow first is that if you were to paint the blue directly over the burnt sienna it would probably turn out just a little too dark. I'm using a nice warm orange to start off the window light followed by cadmium yellow. Mix up some black with just a little blue for the bushes growing along the garden wall. For the three background trees, I'm simply using the same mix I used for the bushes. And I still find it a bit scary painting over the background like this. <laughs> Time to scumble in the snow now with my round bristle brush. And as a wee tip, just make sure it's dry. Okay, I think that's enough work on the snow for now. Let's start work on the little boy's bicycle. So for this, I've just mixed up some thalo blue with a little white. I want the little boy's bicycle to look interesting, so I've put a tiny wheel on the front. On go the mudguards. And while that's drying, let's make a start on a big old foreground tree, which is just black with a little yellow ochre mixed in as well. If you notice here, to paint the tree trunks, I'm twisting my brush as I go up. This just gets the paint on nice and even. I think I like the shape of this tree, very pleased the way it turned out. I'm painting in some lighter areas of bark on the tree trunk here, just using yellow ochre and a little black. Okay, let's get a nice warm yellow ochre jacket on this young lad now, because I think it's getting quite cold. And he's wearing his nice new black corduroy jeans today, which his granny got him for Christmas.
I think I'll paint him having a bit of fun freewheeling down the road past his house. So to do that we'll have to paint both his legs the same length. white and a little burnt sienna for his head and hands burnt sienna and a little black for his hair put a flat cap on his head and let's give him a nice white woolly scarf to keep his neck warm as well In go the window frames, which is black and a smidgen of yellow ochre. And for the window light reflecting on the snow, I've simply mixed a tiny bit of orange in with white. Tap, tap, tap the snow on the branches. Gently does it. Alright, so the little boy's freewheeling down past his house. Let's paint his little dog running along beside him. A tiny dot for his eye, some doggy footprints, and I think I'll paint in just a skip of snow. Well, I think this little painting is just about finished. So until the next time, take care and thanks for watching.